<coughs> Hello and welcome to Farming Simulator 17. I'm Andy and this is the second episode of Let's Play on the North Brabant map. So we are <laughs> cultivating, which is taking forever. I've been pretty much working I've done like six hours or so since <laughs> I started last episode. And I basically just fertilized the fields once and now I'm cultivating. So I got this cultivator and the reason why it's not as it's actually overlapping is because if I set it to it's a four meter cultivator but if I set it to three meters it um, it doesn't leave any bits that uh, I have to do afterwards so it takes longer to cultivate each field but I don't have to do anything when it's done it's, it's really done. So, and this is the, the 1300, if you remember the old school tractor. So, and over here we have the 1800 working away, the 1800 intercooler. And I don't remember if I showed you this in the last episode, but this is, uh, what's it called? Vogel knot, Vogel newt. Oh, it's a cultivator anyway. So that's working away on field well this is one of the fields that was were unnamed so it's working away here i don't actually have to do all this cultivating because i have a direct seeder i could just run the direct seeder but i want to cultivate because then i can do another lap of fertilization then it will do cultivate and then we'll do a seeding and after the seeding we can uh, it will grow and we'll do one row of um what do you call it? Spraying. Spraying is the word I'm looking for. And I'm going to show you another thing. So here's our Mega 208 class dominator. The thing I'm going to show you is this one. This little beauty. And it's a little beauty. The, the um, Mercedes Band, the MB Track 700. So, uh, and I also have a Profi Diamond uh, spray on the back here which looks pretty cool. So, uh, link is in the description. I also have a link to an MB1000 uh, to 1100. If you want to have that. Uh, I haven't, uh, haven't, I don't, I, I don't have that installed. So this is the one we have. And this is the one uh, that we track. So you can get standard attachment, front hydraulics, front loader attachment if you want it, or force cage if you want that. 700, 800, 900. And then I have a bunch of different 900 versions. Uh, so the one I have is the 700 because it's the cheapest. Wheel set up, you can run standard, narrow tires, which we have, uh, wide wheels, uh, wide wheels, silver still, silver still, I don't know, silver still. Well, that was hard. Twin wheels, small, and then it's only twin wheels on the back. Twin wheels, big. Uh, that's also on the back. Narrow wheel, twin wheels. And standard. so narrow twin wheels is also just narrow on the back and the front is default or narrow twin wheels uh, means they have twin wheels narrow twin wheels on the back and then twin narrow track wheels in the front there so. normal windows folding window front folding window back or both and then rotating neck or, or not so not a hugely expensive thing you can as a folding window. Oh, that was weird. Well, how can you close it? Okay. So I guess that works better if you don't have this stuff on the back. And you found the sprayer here on the sprayers. Um, MB Track Damon Profi. So holds 1200 liters. So it's not a huge a huge spray what it works I, the, habit, the idea is to get this I have this already and I'm, I have the Coon package installed so I'm thinking about getting this one I could also get the Amazon that's a thousand liters this is 1500 so it's slightly more um, I'm thinking of it because I have a front loader attachment uh, three front three point attachment on the tractor so get this and then you would have a 1200, so you would get 2700 liters. Cool. 
one other way we could go is to go into the cotter pack and get this one a universal transport tank that holds 2000 which and this is much cheaper too so this might be actually the best best thing to do the point the only thing is that it's well it looks kind of ridiculous that's the only thing it's very big but then again it's, it's very big but it works so that could be one thing. I'm holding off on that. I don't think I'm thinking about going with the universal, universal thing. Um, I want to drive this around. I just want to show you. So it has really cool IC control, well, the door and stuff. But yeah, the folding stuff there. I don't know why it's drinking beer. You can fold the mirrors. Which is kind of cool. It folds in and downwards, and that that's pretty good for. Let's say we're backing, we want to back it up somewhere. We can actually see where we where we need to go. Lots of things there. Um, so uh, that's one thing. Cool. Um, can open the bonnet here. Want to? Looks also kind of cool. Um, let's see. This one is that one. Rear trailer. Attach it back down. Let's see if we have trailer attachments there. Okay, so that moves up and down. That's pretty smart. Depending on what sort of tool you want, in or tool you want to have there. Oh, that's pretty cool. I like that. And uh, what else? That's it. We could lower the window there. Want to? I don't think I had a front. Actually, there. If I had a front, just a version with a front window there, you could open that. You could open the door if you want to. Here is something. Attached side looking terminal if trade is attached. Okay. Grimmy terminal. I don't have that. Oh, I have to try that, I'm sorry. We, no, we don't have side looking, we have... Moody... I don't know if this, well, this probably won't work. I don't need the side looking then. It's kind of cool that it, there actually was an attachment point there. This won't work, but I can try it. So if you have um, a side looking that's then you can cook this up to it. Which is fairly cool. So basically basically the idea for this I guess well sometimes we feed feed the uh, Animals we could use this too, but otherwise it can lower this up and down by the mouse button, which is fairly easy. So that's pretty much the thing I wanted to show you in this episode. Um, we have this fertilizer field, so we can go fertilize stuff if we want to. What else? That's pretty much it. Food-wise, uh, animal-wise, we have 4,293 liters. Really cool. Good. That will bring a little bit of an income cleanliness. We could clean that up later, but we need a front load for that. This is working way slowly because it's not the most widest one, but this is working away, and this is working away too. Don't know which field will do then? Maybe forty-one. After this, we'll do forty-one. I don't think so. 
Ah, oh, well, um, I don't know what else to do on this episode. It's sort of working away, and that's the way it is. And the way it has to be. The I can actually run run faster than tracker. Is that possible? I can run from it actually. Weird. Oh, I guess that's good. Take a look at the seasons mod, uh, menu mod on seasons mod and say season menu. We can see that we could actually start planting wheat, barley, or canola if we wanted to. I'll, I think I'll plant a few of these fields, and then we have to wait until day four before we can plant soybeans. And soybeans is the, the crop I'm actually wanted, what I want to plant. Um, grass. King. We don't have sugar cane, let's stop it installed. Um, so, I'll, I think we'll do a few fields of weeds, a few fields, fields of barley, and we'll a few fields of soybeans. Oh, I should check, by the way. Check how much money you get for that. Prices. So, here, station grain mill seems to be where you sell a lot of stuff, most of it actually. You get seared for these? Weird. Um, well, you can say well, it's a spinnery, but most of the stuff we want to sell a lot is this. And we could sell them either in grain mill or not tell them, not them then seem. Look at the, the um, soybeans, they look like sort of uh, the same prices. Canola is good, but I think we'll go with mostly well wheat. We'll mix it up a little bit. Wheat, barley, and then sugar beans. Uh, sugar beans, soybeans. Seems like a good mix, I think. What else can I do? I could try actually. I don't know if this will work. We can take this and go fertilizing some fields again because I have done a bunch of fields, so that was bad. This will look quite ridiculous since this is such a big. Oh, no. Okay, well, it did work. It looks funny. <laughs> Weird. Don't know if this will actually manage to pull. Well, it did manage to pull it. I guess that's always something. Not fast, it's it's working quite a lot that was close there I got through. Oh sorry. My bad. Oh it showed up. What is what is this? I was too fast. I guess that was the problem. That didn't work. But this one shows up when you have that one. Oh that's pretty cool. Well, we'll leave it there. That's awesome. I'm not really sure. We we'll have to try this. I'm not 100% sure this will work. Not because it's a small tractor. It is a small tractor, but because uh, I'm not sure we could spray this field again. We can set it up and try. So, So that's field... 27 Go from there Go three headlands I, I want to see these ones It's fertilizing, so we check our little map here. We should have where is it? A new over here. Somewhere. No, there it is. So there's the that's a blue, darker blue level, which is this one in between, and then 
will seed and after we seed it we can actually put some uh, we'll let it start growing and when it starts growing we can uh, then put some liquid fertilizer on there works pretty nicely oh, no way. seems kind of nice It's actually doing this fairly good. Going like 19 kilometers per hour, which is pretty fast. Considering this tractor doesn't have a lot of power at all. But we could put a weight on the front there, but I don't know. I'm not sure we are. But maybe. Slightly back heavy there. We have a weight. Makes me. Uh, I can't remember. Go here. I think on here somewhere there should be a weight. Do we have weights? That one. That one. Do we have another weight somewhere. Not a hundred percent sure on that one. Didn't seem like we had a weight there somewhere. Anyway, um, and then we're gonna cut it short. I, I don't know why I keep saying anyway. I'm sorry about that. Uh, we're gonna cut it short here and leave it at this episode. So this has been the second episode on the North Brabant map. I'm gonna do a lot of things off screen because it's such a large. I mean, just look at the map. We own four, 31, 32. 29, 33, 34, 36, 45, 42, 41, 40, 18, 9, 17, uh, 21, 23, 24, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And, and then some grass fields, but we own a bunch of, like a huge amount of fields here where you could um, uh, plant, plant some arables and then harvest them. I want to go, this is a sheep. Oh, okay. This is actually kind of cool. Except it's weird that there was stuff standing in there. Wool pallets. As soon as you... Okay, so here is where you get the wool pallets. I guess you put either water... I think this looks like water. And this looks like hay bales. Hay. And this, I'm guessing, is where you get the sheep. So you get some sheep there. You buy those. Uh, who wants some sheep? We're not going to This is actually a really pretty cool solution to your map. Just adding it to the edge there, and then that's where they are, the sheep. So, uh, cool. Um, so, I'll see you next time. We'll see what we'll do then. I haven't figured it out yet. We'll see how much far I get from off screen work. And um, I'm Andy. Have a great day, everyone. If you like this channel, please subscribe. If you like this episode, please. <laughs> oh, God, why am I saying? If you like this channel, please subscribe. If you like this episode, please hit the like button, leave a comment, or share. Take care, everyone. See you soon. Bye-bye.